Okay, so let's get this set up. It's uh, gonna be pretty easy actually to set this up. So, you guys can just take this. So, see these two? So that's the good thing about this. You guys can install it whichever way you guys want. Uh, it really does depend which hand you guys are gonna use, but not even that. It depends what you guys are cutting. Maybe you guys will be more comfortable putting it in the other side. It depends, once again, on you guys, what you're comfortable with. And obviously you can guys always take this off and put it in the other side. It's no problem. So make sure it's tight, all right? So that's one of your first steps. Well, I shouldn't even say this is the first step, but you know, it, it will make this more comfortable to play around with once you have that. So what is this? This button is actually, see this rotation? So this, if you once you press this, you can no longer rotate it. So this will actually come off, okay? So the whole thing's not rotating, only this part, and that's why I'm pressing this. So this is pretty much a break, all right? So you guys have to hold that down. Then you take this off, and depending on your disc, you guys are gonna install it like so, all right? And then you take this, and you put it on, all right? Uh, from there, you guys have to tighten it up. So we did get this with it, and this is really important, so don't lose it. And you guys wanna make it tight. All right, so what happens if you guys don't tighten it up correctly? Well, my experience, no big deal. But uh, then again, if you guys leave even way too loose, it's a big deal. So there we go. So now it's nice and tight. As you can see, uh, the disc is going this way. So you guys should see the yellow on this side. So let's see that. And you're all set. So you guys are set to go. Um, you guys will notice a button here and a button here, right? So you have to hold this down and then you guys can press this down. So this is like a safety, right? So just in case, so you guys won't just press this by accident and cut your hands. Um, you guys will need to press this press the two things in order for you guys to actually make this machine work. Um, apart from that, it it is heavy, okay? Um, I wouldn't really expect this not to be heavy. It's something that you guys want to be heavy, actually. And depending on what you guys want to cut, you want to get the appropriate disc. Uh, what I recommend usually is not getting these type of discs, all right? Because these are disposable, basically. Um, what I re highly recommend is getting a diamond one, okay? Because that one will work with almost everything and um, it will last you a very long time. So you guys don't have to keep buying more and more of these guys. Anyways, that's it for this unboxing and quick tutorial on how to set this up. If you guys have any comments, questions, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.